Hey guys, it's just Little Cloth here, and today I'm sorry, this Monster Legends week, so we have a bunch of new leaked events for you guys, so let's just go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so the first leaked event is the Monster Wood Crazy Event Cyber Monday, so there are going to be quite a few Cyber Monday Crazy Events. And the first one is the Monster Wood Event, and basically you can get Mythic Ambrosia, Nebula, Latum, and Stardust, which are all really good for ranking up your Mythics, so definitely do this event. And then the next one is for Relics, so basically you'll be able to watch ads for Diamond Relics, pretty much. So I definitely suggest that you guys do this event as well. Well. And then we have a top monsters pretty much where you can get five plantinomation cells and an era dawn chest every time you get a successful breeding. So this is good for ranking up plantinomation and for getting era dawn chest, which are obviously really good. And then there's going to be a Marley event where you can get Marley, which is a YouTuber monster. So I definitely suggest that you guys do this event in order to get him because I don't know when he'll be coming back. And then we have Piper Shock, which is going to be the next bounty hunt monster. Let's go and see if he's good. All right, so he has a single target nanovirus extra turn, which is decent. He has a low metal damage, which I don't know why he has that. He has an AoE nanovirus and stamina to himself, which is okay. Moderate water damage to one enemy with freeze and stamina leak, which is okay. And moderate water damage to all enemies and freeze to all enemies, which is okay. He's just kind of mediocre, honestly. He's not that good. And then we have Thunder King Jelly, which is going to be the next breeding event monster. So let's go and see if he's good. So he has moderate thunder damage AoE, shock, and daze, which is pretty decent. He has a single target activate cooldowns with drowned, which is pretty good. And he actually has an AoE activate cooldowns, which is really good. And then we have Hydrarion. I don't know what event he's going to be in, but I guess we'll find out soon. So he has AoE drowned, which is okay. He has AoE boiling, which is pretty good. That's actually a new status effect, which is very good. And he has a single target moderate water damage, which is pretty good. He has a single target boiling, which is pretty good. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So overall, he's a pretty decent a monster he seems like he'd be a good attacker and then we have the descriptions right here you can go and pause the video if you want oh and it looks like this is actually going to be the bounty hunter monster so the paid one and then we have a team thanksgiving event where you'll be able to request and donate for mythic cells basically so yeah definitely do this it'll be amazing and then a new status tester area drowned which i'm assuming this monster is going to have so yeah that is going to be it for this video don't forget to like share, and subscribe for more at least videos like this and i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye